Speaking of the Senate, congratulations to Jackie Lambie. Now, I've said plenty over the years about Jackie Lambie, but we buried that hatchet and it's done uh, when we hung out in uh, uh, Launceston, when she was one of the very few who were actually willing to jump on this show and be part of the forum uh, that was uh, in the lead-up to the election when she wanted to speak about uh, what she wanted to do for the Senate in Tasmania. Now, she has won her position for the next six years as the final elected senator in Tasmania, and she did this with bugger all money and all of a big heart and plenty of push. Now, we'll see where she goes in the next little while, but she's always welcome on this show. We're doing our best to make sure that we can set up a regular chat with her as we do with Corey Bernardi, as we do with Pauline Hanson, and as we will tonight with Rex Patrick from Centre Alliance. Put simply, four out of the six crossbenchers, that's what's needed to get anything done in this country. Jackie Lambie is one of them. She's very strong on veterans' affairs. I would suggest the Prime Minister start working with her on that particular front as soon as possible so she gets some skin in the game to actually be involved in, uh, well how things actually work, rather than just playing the big game of no. But congratulations to Jackie Lambie. She did this, and she did it from the absolute outside, without the free run and free help of Channel 2, because they were too busy, well, thinking the woke revolution was coming, didn't they? It's only been a month, by the way. I know they like to pretend nothing to see here, nothing to see here.